guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I came, I saw, I came, I saw, I praise the Lord, the break the Lord, I take what's mine, then take some more. It rains, it pours, it rains, it pours. So, one of the days we've all been looking forward to, Monday the 12th of April, finally arrived and everyone was in the shops. Everyone was waking up at 9, 10, lining up for hours in the shops. And I was like, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. What did I do? I did that. So, I followed the crowd. I woke up at a very bad time. And I went shopping. And this is my haul. I'll cut out the chit chat. Or everyone knows how a haul works. Welcome to my channel. This is my first haul. You know who I am. My name is Leona. Welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, drop any video ideas that you guys have too. Um. Yeah. So I'm going to be doing a Primark haul. This is my first time shopping in Primark. Actually, like if you know me, Primarni, Primarni, Primark. Some people don't know it's called Primarni. Like, you'll be like, really? Leona, you want to Zara, H&M, Topshop, rest in peace, Topshop. But I was like, you know what? Might as well, I'm a uni student. I need to be shopping in my budget and stop depending on my mum and dad for money. So for any references, these are my sizes and what I typically wear, just so you know how it fits on my body. Personally, I would describe myself as a middle-sized person. I'm not on the more plus side in certain areas and I'm not skinny so I'm just in the middle so these are my sizes and I'll be showing you guys how I styled it on this side and you can see all the outfits and I'll put the prices definitely with some of the photos if I can find them let's get on to the video might as well start with what I'm wearing right now what's in right now is a whole baggy shorts and oversized top I'm wearing this oversized top from Pretty Little Thing. I did not get this in the haul. And I'm wearing these men's shorts that I got from the men's section in Primark. They were five pounds and I got them in gray and black. Let me stand up and show you the shorts that, yeah, yeah. I'm wearing the shorts right now, but these are in men's, they were five pounds. Then I also got these shorts in men's extra large, they were five pounds. And the other shorts that I got from Primark were these cycling shorts in a medium so i got these cycling shorts and to be honest they just fit so well like i was a bit skeptical the cycling shorts i got were from pretty little thing and they were shape sized even i'm not shapely body even though i don't have the Amber Wells figure i still prefer to get shaped just so it's just a bit tighter at the waist but these did the job these are a medium they are two pound fifty from prime money to be honest, the shorts, the men's shorts were surprisingly so comfortable. Like I've been looking, I've really been looking for shorts. Boohoo man literally ran out of shorts, a pack of two for 18 pounds. And I was gonna get them from Pretty Little Thing shorts. But then I was like, you know what? Why don't I just go to Primark and actually see if I like their style on myself? I do. You really could go to JD and spend 30 pounds on Nike shorts, but at the end they're just a pair of shorts like it's just the fit that matters and it depends on how you feel in the clothes anyway so i got the primark shorts they're comfortable they're soft i like them pretty good pretty decent i then got this quite large hoodie a black zipped hoodie now if you know me literally i have a hoodie collection it's quite it just gets bigger like if i want it i'm getting it that sounds spoiled. Let's. I like to collect different colors of hoodies and jumpers. Right now, I'm into zipped hoodies, and I was like, so zipped hoodies are coming back. I need myself a nice big black one. So I got this one from Primark. I got it in the size extra large, and it was. And it was seven pounds. <laughs> to be honest, it's so soft. Like I'm so surprised with the quality. If you want hoodies, I normally go to H and M in the men's section because their hoodies are just and they just have the graphic designs and they're just so comfortable. Like they're normally 19 pound, 20 pound, but like I'll spend that on a hoodie. But this seven pound, I'm hoping it survives in the wash. So if this is not the same comfort after a good wash, then that's just Primark for you, I guess. And if you know anything about me, you know that I absolutely love and adore Billie Eilish. Like she is just, she is just wow, you know, wow, like, 
she's accomplished so much we're like near the same age so she has five grammys and i'm chilling here with no a levels just gcse's <laughs> Yay! But I got this oversized Billy Eilish top that I saw on TikTok from Primark. It's literally the cutest thing ever. I'm loving the orange and the black. I'm really digging orange right now. I think orange is orange is new black. Orange is actually a very nice colour. Knowing Billy, I know that she likes to make stuff oversized already. So I decided just to stick with my size and I got it in a medium and it's just the perfect oversize. If you want it a bit bigger, just more of like a big big one i would say get just one size up but the medium is made for people who are 12 to 14 and i'm normally a 12 anyway sometimes a 14 if it's in this area but this beautiful this was eight pound from primark also from primark i looked when i went to primark in my local area i looked for bodysuits and i just they weren't there they said ma'am no i looked for the gym wear primark they said ma'am Unless you're an extra small or a small. And I was just like, hello. Clearly not an extra small here. I'm literally a medium or a large. And if it's gym wear, we're gonna go for a large because we want it to be nice and snug. So all of those cute ones that you saw on TikTok, they were, they were there on the floor. People trampled all over them. They were gone. But when I went to Primark again in Stratford, I found this beautiful bodysuit in Primark and she was just calling my name. The quality is giving me H&M, it's giving me nice thickness. This was six pound, it's in a medium. I loved it, I literally saw it and I was like, they do bodysuits, they're in Primark. Like, I don't know why I really looked down on Primark for so long, all my life, just not going there from young. I was so used to Zara, I was so used to H&M, Topshop, Pretty Little Thing, so I was just like, you know what, Primark? I'ma stop sleeping on Primark. I'ma stop sleeping on Primark. Last but not least, I got myself a face covering with my initial on it. Gonna sneeze. <laughs> That's me, sorry, I have really weird sneezes. Yeah. It's all the clothes. I have too many clothes in, on the floor. You guys don't wanna see the floor right now, it's just disgusting. <laughs> Bless me. You're welcome. I don't understand how people spend so much in Primark because I was literally at the checkout just lining up and I saw face masks. I was like, there's a pandemic. And I mean, I do want a black face mask. But one with my initial on it, I was I was like, what? So I got it. It was £1.50 from Primark and I think it's really cute. It has an L because basically Leona, oh, yeah, duh. come on guys give it the program give it the times but that was my shop in primark and i spent 29 pounds let's move on to h&m so i will not like so i can't lie to you it's just like everyone wants to come out today so I can't lie to you guys, I've been planning this video for so long, the hunt for the perfect trousers. And I just think with my height, five foot eight, and with my size and my figure and a healthy lockdown weight, it's hard to find trousers that are not so baggy, but are still baggy, won't stick to your thighs, but won't just look weird on the ankles if you get what i'm trying to say finding baggy trousers for me right now has been a struggle i will have to admit but i saw these in the men's section now i need to get myself out of the men's section because i need to remember that men don't have the same hips the same structure as women do so if you're trying to find baggy trousers and you go to men's and they're still tight at the thighs don't do what I did and cry about it because it's it's just gonna happen. Like you're literally gonna either have to get like a two XL or just go women's and get it. And normally women's ones are like all oh, ripped here or doing all of this fancy fancy stuff. And you're just like, I just want good trousers. I just want baggy trousers, mate. I'm not really bothered about the rips and the looks and your. I mean, like you want your bum to look nice and but still, you know what I mean. You still just want normal trousers. <laughs> I'm waffling, let's get on. I found these beige trousers in the men's section. 
Large, yeah, I know. These are an extra large from men's from H&M. They were $19.99. And to be honest, it's still not giving me the bagginess at the thighs, but I know that's just something that I have to deal with with my structure and the way my body is shaped. But they're still very cute and they're still giving me baggy vibes. And then they have the little, you know, they have all of that vibes. So I mean, I'm enjoying them. I'm digging it. Like, I'm taking it to be honest. I think they'll look really, really good on white tops, which I bought, on beige tops, which I bought. Just, you need basic pieces which you can just pair up with basic pieces to look like a whole mm, and you're just like, yeah, this is just plain basic colours, but you make it work. Is Do you get what I'm trying to do? This is a basics haul, because it's basically Leona. Oh. Y'all don't appreciate me too much. Y'all don't appreciate me. Y'all don't appreciate me, man. I'll be doing all this for you guys. Anyways. So those were the men's trousers from H&M. These were the only trousers I bought because I was looking at the baggy trousers and they were like in the 30s. I went to River Island, they were in the 40s. I went to Tommy Hilfiger, they were in the 85s. I have been looking for baggy trousers that will fit my shape with my thighs. Being thick with two C's is hard. I'm joking, I'm really joking. <laughs> I'm joking. Yeah, you know. C'est la vie. So that was the only thing that I got from men's. I also did get another jumper. I saw the color and I was like, I must. I just must. Like it was just, it was, it was like a blue. That's not a, let me show you. Let me show y'all, please. Can we have some commotion? for the hoodie look at it just i don't even watch star wars like that i was dragged to star wars the force awakens is that even the right one i was dragged to watch star wars and luke skywalker and blah de, blah blah but this hoodie was just the color it was just mm, and the bag it was just it was calling my name it was really calling my name this was on sale so i got this hoodie in i suppose the men's section and it used to be $24.99, probably because it's a merchandise hoodie, that's what they normally do. And I got it for 12. Do you see what happens when you wait? Like, I remember seeing this type of blue and I was like, no, let me get a pink hoodie. I don't actually have a pink hoodie. And now I've gotten a blue for cheaper. So this is in the size small because it is men's. The quality is just, the quality of H&M hoodies, I, I love H&M hoodies, like literally H&M plug me, please. I spend too much money in H&M, please sponsor me. If I could buy every single one, every single color, I would, but I need to explore different clothes and that's what we're trying today, so yeah. Moving on to the basic tops. Now I normally don't wear racer, back tops, vests. Anything that shows too much arms, you're not catching me in it. You'll catch me in it with a hoodie over. So I thought for the summer, I'm gonna try something new. I'm going to explore. I'm going to become confident with my body and how I look because I shouldn't be afraid of. What are you gonna do with your arms? Oh my God, like I'm just. Because I'm quite tall, quite, you know. I just wanted something new. I wanted something cute. I wanted to look like a girl. The hunt for this top. I think the CCTV in Westville, Stratford, H&M were looking at me and being like, this girl is planning on stealing something. Because the way I was roaming around, trying to find this top in a large, cause I thought, you know, chest area, it's not really gonna, not gonna really work unless I find the large or unless I find more of these tops in different colors. I didn't, a lovely lady helped me, she found me a medium and just look at her. This is a beige racer back vest cropped top. It was $3.99 in H&M. And honestly, when I saw it was medium and I saw the size, I was like, ma'am, this ain't gonna fit your area. This is gonna make you look stupid, but it worked. I was so happy because I don't normally wear tops like that. I would recommend wearing a strapless bra underneath or if you're lucky enough, don't wear anything. Cause 
lucky. But I would wear for my ladies, I would wear a strapless bra underneath. It holds them up, cushions them nicely. Moving over from beige, had to go get myself a brown one too. This is more of a vest top, so you can tuck it in. I wish it was shorter, and I know that they have shorter ones. I'm gonna look online, I bet they do have shorter ones. But she is just so pretty not to get. Beautiful, beautiful quality. Like the quality H&M do, like amazing. So I got this in brown. It was $5.99 and I could not be happier with how it looked, how it fit. It was just carving it nicely. I was just super, super happy. Probably pair these with like white trousers, white jeans. I don't actually have any, so that's why I'm not wearing them. Definitely would pair this with that. Also with the brown ones, I got one in white, just another cute vest top, the exact same in a size medium for $5.99. Then I got the same in black, same vest top, $5.99, racer back, in a size medium. And I was just, I was loving it so much. Just something that's a bit out of my comfort zone. I just really wanted to try something new and I was so glad with them. I'm so happy with the tops that I've got. And then the last two things, I needed a few dressy tops, just a few tops to go out with the girls. I'm really one for crop tops, like I might not have the fly, flat, flat, but I do love a crop top. So I got this from H&M. It's like a cute cropped one, like my gym wear one, so I definitely wanted one that's not my gym wear. It's nice long sleeved and it's got a few like curves around that area and it curves round. It's ribbed, really, really good quality. So it is more on the expensive side, it's 12 99 and I got this in a large. And last but not least, I like to just thank my mum for having the eye of a designer, the eye of a fashionista. She spotted this from the distance and was like, yes. First I was a bit hesitant, but when I put it on, I was like, Yes, I love these tops. You would rarely ever catch me. Okay, it is rare to catch me in a nice, cute crop top. Like if I'm wearing a crop top, it's just a crop top to wear with hoodies, or something like that, or a crop top to wear underneath my hoodies. They're not shown. The crop tops are never shown. But for a dressy crop top, that wasn't me. But now, 2021, trying new things. My mum, shout out to my mum, found this beautiful top. I was a bit hesitant on the sleeves, but when I tried it on, I was just like, yes, this is a bit of me. She used to be $14.99, but I got it for eight. I love the detailing at the front, like the little rouge, little in the middle. And then she's got her own stuff going on at the back. It was giving me milkmaid vibes and I love the whole milkmaid dresses, milkmaid tops. It was a good hunt and literally there was three left and the other two weren't in my size and we found this at the back. I was thinking about lace at the front so we got this in a size 14. This is the last top in the haul, honestly. Fell in love with her. She, she will be worn. And she will be known as that top. Yes, she is that top. And since rings are in right now, I just got a bunch of rings from H&M for $9.99 in a size medium and large. I'm really getting into rings right now. Like, if you know me, I'm always wearing... Okay, well, not right now. Right, not right now, man. Don't hold me into it. But I'm normally wearing, like, gold jewellery, rose gold jewellery, silver here and there. My dad got me the silver necklace for Christmas. And I have this silver hill figure watch Tommy hill figure watch but normally you'll catch me in gold jewelry so when i saw these rings rings are so in right now they're chunky they weren't so thin rings literally just they just zhuzh up your look i feel like jewelry is so important like i take my necklaces so seriously like get me a necklace for my birthday wow loving you because i love necklaces my watches too watches are a very essential statement piece these are the rings and that is the end of my haul. Oh my God, I've done a haul, wow. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to see more hauls, just let me know down below. And yeah, I feel, I kind of like this. So to be honest, I don't really buy a lot of clothes. Like I might say, I bought this, I bought that, but I would literally go to Pretty Little Thing, grab two tops and call it a day like a couple of months so this was quite a big shop for me but i do hope you guys enjoyed it stay safe guys don't get too rowdy i know stuff is opening up but let's be sensible guys we don't want another lockdown we we just want to live up to 21st of june that's all we're praying for so let's be sensible guys hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you next time
Bye. It rains, it pours, it rains, it pours. Yeah. I sold the pack, the loose, the hard. Yeah. I listen to X, I peep the bars, yeah. the snakes, the rats, the cats, the dogs, the